I'm Anil Kumar and here is a multiple choice question on parallel lines. Which of the following set of lines parallel? 2x minus y equals to 4 and y equals to 2x minus 4. On the left side we have one line which is 2x minus 4 and we are trying to figure out which one of these is parallel to the given line. Second option is y equals to 2 plus 4x, third is y equals to 2 minus 4x and then we have y equals to 2x plus 4. Now what is the condition for parallel lines? Parallel lines means same slope, right? Same slope. Most of the students think that that is the definition for the parallel lines, right? With this example you will learn something more about it and that's the whole idea of having this question here. Now what is the slope of first line? Let us say this is line 1, this is set of line 2. So m1 for us really is how much? If I take y on this side I get slope of 2, right? So I can write this equation as, uh, okay let me write the equation. We can write 2x minus y equals to 4. If I rearrange it we get y equals to 2x minus 4, right? So that is the equation, right? So that is how both are equivalent equation. So we know slope m1 is indeed 2, right? Now if you see these lines, then the two equations which qualify for same slope, slope of 2, m2 should be how much? Should be 2. So this equation qualifies and that also qualifies. But are both uh, parallel? Can you answer that part? Well, if you compare the equations, you'll find that y equals to 2x minus 4, y equals to 2x minus 4 are exactly same lines. They are coincident. They are not parallel. Let me graph and show you. I feel this is extremely important for all my students to understand. So when we have this line y equals to 2x minus 4, y intercept is minus 4, slope is 2. So I can draw something like this, right? So that is the given line L1, right? So this is the line L1. Now, if I draw y equals to 2x minus 4, it will overlap, right? It will be on the same. They are not parallel. They are coincident. Do you see that? The solution is D because that one has the same slope but the y-intercept is different. Do you see that? So that is the solution. This is plus 4. This was minus 4. So the solution is D. So important thing which we learn here is slope should be same. That means m1 equals to m2 but the other part is the y-intercept should not be same. Right? So they should have same slope and different y intercept let me squeeze it in there okay so that is what you learn so parallel lines means let me write here big and bold same slope different y intercept the whole idea is that you should get this in mind don't make this mistake. If they have same slope and same y-intercept, then there are infinite solutions to them and they are coincident lines. But if their slope is different, I mean if their slope is same but y-intercept is different, then they are parallel lines and they don't intersect. I hope that's absolutely clear. Thank you and all the best.